Stay for me. No, y'all know I'm newsy. And I was watching some like little news clip. And it was talking about all the side effects from the vaccine from Pfizer. And they mentioned that one side effect was swollen lymph nodes. Now, when you got swollen lymph nodes, your lymph node, your lymphatic system basically is like little spots that flush out germs and bacteria. And when your lymph nodes are swollen, that means that they are inflamed and under attack. So the first round of people, <clears throat> a wide majority of them, chills, fever, nausea, diarrhea, and swollen lymph nodes. Those are all symptoms that come along with HIV. And if you know, this technology for the uh, vaccine uses messenger RNA. But what I also wanted to point out to y'all was that uh, four people out of the people that they studied got Bell's palsy. Now, I had experienced Bell's palsy before. Like, if you could notice one of my eyes, it doesn't open up as wide as my other one, and I can't get my eye to lift up over that side. And that happened one day when I was outside smoking, and it was cold, and my face froze up. So basically, like, it's paralysis. And sometimes they can say it's a viral infection, but it's literally paralysis on one side of your face. Like, I just got my lip to start smiling bright. But it took years for my face to even get to this level. And you can see my eye is not the same. So I feel like people, we got to not let them make us test dummies. Do not let them make you a test dummy. Don't let them try out their new medicines on you. Try natural remedies. If you check out my other videos, I give them plenty of them, plenty of them. Um, my hemoglobin is definitely uh, 13. And I have medical records that can prove that. When your hemoglobin is low, you usually have cancer, sickle cell, um, lupus, anything like that. Because your body does not have the oxygen that it needs to pump through whatever organ that's failing. So, follow my page. I try to drop some jewels. Um, I'm not the best at this yet, but I'm getting there. But that's my testimony at the Bell's Palsy.